We are here at Hot Pan over on the east side of St. Paul. We have come here many times, but um, we've been having people ask us when we get here, so he's about to see. We usually get this one. I saw it's cheaper at Pat Blue's, man. I don't remember being $179. You know what? These actually look really good. Coconut roll. I forgot how much stuff they have here. I'm trying not to go overboard. <laughs> what is that? What is this? Cooking wine. I've been wanting that for like the longest. Tamarind concentrate. We never use that. Oh, so you're just getting stuff. <laughs> Look at this big bag of mushroom. Yeah, like fungus. I want you to guess which one Peter's gonna grab. Either bok choy or yuk choy. And is he gonna grab the plastic here or these ones? Let's see. Would you just get what you're gonna get? <laughs> you got the yuck choy. Uh, I love these, but it's a little bit too pricey. I did not know he was going to do both. So I like shopping at Hatian because it's cleaner, but their prices are also more expensive, which kind of sucks. Because these mushrooms that I usually get at the other Asian market are only a couple dollars. This is like a dollar more. <sighs> Gotta get my tofu. This is a new kimchi brand I've never seen. I wonder if it's good. It's spicy level hot. Hmm. Should I get that one? Or should I get this one? They're both the same price. Brand to try. <clears throat> you want to give that brand a try? Yeah. They also have cucumber kimchi. Spicy level mild. This I one. got a radish one to it. Radish one? Yeah. I'll just stick to kimchi now. They're all kimchi. This one's cabbage. Yeah, I'm going to stick to this one. Okay. What are these? Have y'all tried these before? Where are these? Oh, maybe it's cheese. It looks like she's holding cheese. But he's holding a soccer ball. So what maybe not. Fish cake. That's what these are. Huh. So that means that these must be fish cakes as well. Okay, I'm assuming this is fish. If you know what these are, please leave a comment below. When did they come up with the spicy dill? When did this become a thing? You know I'm about to get this. Oh my gosh. I'm supposed to be showing y'all around because Peter has disappeared again. So sorry if it's me and not Peter. I'm not sorry. This is our channel. What am I talking about? 
We really want one of these. We're not gonna grab them today though, because we barely got room in our apartment anymore. But it's only $22, $22.99. I think I saw cheaper somewhere else though. Of course, every Asian store we go to has all the Asian spoons you can think of. Coffee. Coffee grinder. My mom used to have this as a magnet. Yeah, I don't know where the handle's at. There it is. It's like an old school grinder, yeah. Are these the chips you're talking about? That you wanted me to try instead? Okay. These guys, yep. These are it? These are the ones that I grew up with. Oh, it looks like them. Oh, that's 50 years the original. Oh. Well then. Okay, so I had these before and I totally love them. I could not get enough of them. These, they're so soft. They're like sponge cakes with a little cream inside. And they are so good. Where is them? Blue heat, artificial flavor. Yeah, I don't trust that. Peter, all Takis are artificial flavor. What are you talking about? Chili, hot chili pepper tortilla chips. As shown you. Shrimp chins. Cool. Now for $7.99. Oh, it's the whole pack. Yeah. It's $1.39, I think. Korean pears are so good, but at Target they're only $5 for a three pack. I'm just saying. Look at these pomelos. Just looking at these husks makes me want to make tamales. Uh, look at Peter and his noodles. All their noodles are vegan. At least all the ones I've seen so far. Uh, we have to get flowers before buying other ones. Thank you. Unless I do like it. They look like the same size udon that we have. I think you need the bigger udon. I'm getting my dad one of these because come to find out he likes these. This, if you remember, this one is from our video when Peter had me try one of his, um, some of his childhood snacks. I did not like it, but my dad does, so I'm going to get him one. Did you want one? I'll buy it. Yeah, I'll take this problem. Here's all the junk food you can imagine. Coffee candy. Well, we were done recording for the day, but we ran into all these vegan options. Soy, you know, very soy, vegan shrimp balls, vegan cutlass fish, vegan fish balls, vegan kung pao chicken, citrus spare rib cutlets, vegan smoked drumsticks, lemongrass rolls, vegan ocean shrimp, vegan shredded crab meat, vegan lobster slices, vegan scallop all these things and I'm scared of the ingredients to be honest oh my gosh there's more vegan pork belly 
black pepper pork belly. Yeah, that's interesting. I would actually try that. Maybe not today, but... There's so many things. When did this thing become a thing? Vegan salmon. There's vegan salmon, you guys. Just, I just want to try it and see if it's good. The thing is, it's like the ingredients is my problem. I'd rather just eat some salmon. Okay, so I'm trying the spicy dill pickle potato chips, and um, they're not that spicy. Actually, they just taste like dill pickle ruffles. Peter's right. hungry. Look at this. Yeah. Go with your clan, sir. <laughs> Are those good? Did you sanitize? Okay, then taste a chip. Peter's hungry. Hi, welcome to my Wendy's. Please grab with your order. Hey, uh, can I just do? Did you want anything? Fries. Can I do? Um, just let I, me know when you're ready. Thank okay, you. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's a lot to see on that thing yeah. for. Okay, for starters, I'll get a small fry. A small french fry? Okay. Yeah, and um, I'll do two double stack, and that should be it. Two double stacks? Yeah. All right, your total is 817 at the window. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm in love with the full bowl. <laughs> 